Hey guys, Farmer Granite Gaming here, coming at you with another episode of The Binding of Isaac. This is episode 8, Isaac Rebirth, I should say. Okay, we will really try to make a cane run work. This is getting extremely redundant, but we will really try this time. Hopefully we could at least make it to Mom. I mean, at this point, that that's our, our quest is really just surviving with cane. So, let's just clear this room now. Man, okay. So, I don't know what happened a few runs ago, but apparently Kang does not guarantee very good pills. Unless something affected me throughout the game that caused that to happen, but I got really screwed over by pills last run. So hopefully that will not happen again, hopefully that was just a glitch or something, I don't know. Isaac did update today. That's interesting because butt bombs, toxic blast plus 5 bombs, okay. So I guess it's just another bomb effect. Uh, Larry Jr. Actually, let's test out the bomb effect right here. And that, wow, that actually, wow, that actually affected him. Holy, so that has quite nice range. That might be blast bombs that are, uh, the bomb effect that might be causing it to have that much range, unless bombs just have crazy range and rebirth. But I'm pretty sure that's just the effect acting up there. So that's really cool. It's not bomb, basically, they're just half a health, and now there you go. Okay, so we get. Okay, this is mom's coin purse. This is a bunch of pills, so. Perfect, actually. And health down. Now, you see, I thought Kane was supposed to not make that happen. That's speed down. Wow. And this is what? That's tears down. Well, I mean, wow. Just, just, well, honestly, out of spite, we will try still making this game work, but that's just like three downgrades right off the bat. I really thought Kane could guarantee good pills, or at least okay pills, but I guess not. Seems to be the, the opposite, actually. Seems that with Kane, we're just getting, like, shit pills. Period. Okay. But yeah, that's like three downgrades are off the bat. Several the tiers are crap now. Come on. Okay. And okay. This room is like super easy, but it's kind of tedious with this fire rate. Oh man. <laughs> well, that first item room might have just screwed the entire run, but I don't want to lose hope yet. I really just want to pull this one out of my ass essentially and just win this game. So, let's do this. And this is Forever Alone. Okay, so that's just an attack fly. Okay, two bombs here. I think we'll rely on bombs honestly to take out these these first few bosses because we have so many of them and they have quite a good effect on them as well. They have that effect basically, just like they have the effect of just someone shitting themselves. Okay, this is a tinted rock, I believe. Okay, yes, okay, so Mr. Mega appeared in the basement for that. And we get that. Okay. Uh, we haven't gotten small rock yet. I'm not sure if we have to unlock that or if we already unlocked it and just haven't gotten lucky enough. A small rock would have been really nice there. Okay. We do have two spirit hearts, so there's a high probability of us actually getting a deal with the devil on this floor. Although we only have one heart, so I don't know really how much of a chance we have of taking the item. So I guess we'll just see. Maybe we'll just try getting a deal with uh, the angel rooms. We'll set the present for that. Okay, so Monstro's here. Beautiful bomb. Oh, that was really dumb. Now, is it only me, or is the screen turning brown when we use a bomb? That might only be me. I believe it definitely has an effect on the screen color, though, so that may actually be like... I don't know, does it automatically damage everyone in the room? I'm not sure. If it does have, like, a, an entire room effect, then that's pretty crazy. That seems like ultra powerful. Especially if we got something like uh, Fetus in a Jar. Although Fetus in a Jar is already ultra powerful by itself, to be fair. So we got a health up, so maybe we might be able to take something from this room. Oh god. Um, is this the pact? Missing page to evil up your enemies will pay. So it wasn't the pact, so that kind of sucks, but 
I guess we'll see what that does. It said your enemies will pay, so I'm wondering what effect that is. Okay, what's in here? Just the chest. I believe we also have kind of like a dark glow now because of that. So that seems interesting. We did get evil up, so now we should get a higher chance of a deal with the double room. Which also means that if we manage to get to mom and defeat mom's heart, that was really dumb, but if we manage to defeat mom's heart, uh, we may unlock Satan, actually. Or not unlock him, but be able to access him. So that'll be interesting if we do get carried enough to win this run. Okay, we're against the hairballs over here. Oh man. Aw, oh, damn it. Okay. We really have to get our head in the game. Wow, okay, we, <laughs> we really have to get our head in the game here. Oh man. Okay, there you go. That's our shop, but we have not... We don't have enough money for that. Okay. That is not worth... Damn, this room is really annoying as well. Oh my gosh. Come on. Man, it takes so much damage too. Oh man, I don't know how I managed that, but that was pretty amazing. If I do say so myself. Oh man, that was so dumb. Come on. There you go. Okay. Oh man, do we go for a boss right away though? I don't think we do, I think I think we should really wait to get an item. Just die. Oh my god. Oh, okay, there you go. Oh man, do we go for boss rip? We have these amazing bombs, so I think we actually do. Um, oh man, these bombs are no longer doing... I think that, that first bomb did so much damage, but... Let me compare to the second one anyways. This fly is actually tearing them up though. Oh man, that was dumb. But I guess that's the missing page effect, so now we know. Oh my gosh, don't die in this room. Okay, there you go. We get a health up, spirit heart, and that's about it, I think. So yeah, we let's go look for our item room now. Um, yep. Oh man, we're like on a thread right now. That's lust, so this guy might be a pain, I don't know. Did we get a speed down in the first room? I'm not sure. I'm just gonna assume from now on that we got an everything down in the first room, so as not to fuck myself <laughs> later on during this run. But I think we'll be okay because these rocks are slowing him down here. Oh, okay, there you go. And we also get uh, the virus, right? so let's poison touch. Okay. I believe this is the last path we could go, so we should find the item room here eventually. Oh, that was really dumb damage. Um, okay. It's another health down, I think. Yeah, it is another health down. Now, I wonder if bad pills turn into good pills now this run. Uh, uh, in the end, I guess. Before we die, I wonder if, if we, we pop this. So, yeah. the Our attack fly just like shred in there. So, that was pretty nice. I think we get our attack fly to do the same here. Come at my attack fly, bro. Oh, man. Okay, so that was kind of risky, but kind of worked in the end. So that is nice. Okay. Okay, sorry about that. Okay. 
Uh, now let's go this way, I guess. I mean, I don't really know where to really go from here. I don't know how to take this run. I don't know if I should be taking deals with Devil with the little health that we have. But uh, we'll just have to see, I guess, how it, how it kind of works out. And my strategy so far has been to basically YOLO it, because I really don't know half the effect of half of the new items, I guess. So uh, It's worked, and it's really screwed us over at some point. So uh, I, say, I say we just go off the points of where it's worked and just kind of trust it. What is this? BBF. Big Beautiful Fly. Wow. Okay, so I'm wondering if that blows up or just does damage. Because it looks like an explosive fly. That was health up, so that was actually amazing. Okay, uh, yeah, let's take that one red heart we have here. Also, I'm wondering, if it blows up, will it have the effect of our bombs? Because if it does, that's, that's actually pretty good. That's amazing. So, let's go down to our other rooms now. Uh, we could basically go down to the next floor now. We have nothing else to do on this floor. So that is cool. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's go down to the next floor. Now, this bomb thing seems like it would be super useful versus bosses because it's pretty big. So I think the chance of it hitting is actually not that not that slim compared to other... Uh, Damn, that was stupid. Yeah, but oh my god, okay, so it does blow up and it does have our bomb effect. That is crazy, actually. That seems ultra good. Okay, the mom's bra. So I guess, yeah, I guess it's not bad considering that we had no space for item to begin with. Shoot out all of these fires. Oh my god, okay, so that was really stupid. I wonder if it respawns after it does that, or you can only use it once a room. Oh, it does respawn. Oh god damn. And there you go, wow, so that was really good. Um, okay. Oh my gosh, I'm hoping he'll kill that one. Uh, actually, no, he can't, because it's not. I don't know how I didn't take spike damage there, but... Was that a good thing or a bad thing? Did I just use it? I'm not. Oh my god, they can still proc even with it on. Wow, that was so dumb. Oh my god, wow. Oh my god, please kill them. Okay. That was a terrible room for us right there. That was a really shit room, honestly, but. It probably could have been so much easier. I just kind of overcomplicated it with Mom's Raw. So. Because that was ultra nice. We also get what is that? We got a mushroom item from I think blowing up that mushroom. What's this? Mini mush speed plus range. Oh, okay, that's just a nice I guess random upgrade to get. Oh my god, that's annoying. Holy. Okay. Okay. Yes. Wow, that was just bullshit. I think we basically guaranteed ourselves <laughs> to not get a deal with the devil at this point. Hopefully the game is like merciful with this. So we do have an evil up. Oh thank god it didn't blow up there. And okay. So there is health here so that's really nice. We will blow this up because we have like no health right now. So there you go. Oh man. Okay. That's nice. We actually have enough money and enough keys for the shop now, so that's really cool. Okay. And our boss room is right there, so hopefully this room goes by quite quickly. So I think that actual that bomb effect that affects the entire room might actually just weaken the enemies. So that's really nice. And definitely made this room a lot easier. And there you go, it's already done. So let's go see what our boss has in store for Okay, so it's just gritty. So actually this is good because our bomb will constantly hit him because he's so big. This is actually quite good. And our fly could actually just tear gritty up here. 
Maxi just to like be able to really speed this up just to our fly. Come on, attack fly. Okay, that bomb fly is gonna explode right there. Wow, okay, yeah, so that bomb fly really helped during this entire thing. And there you go, so all we get is a shot speed up for that. Honestly, it's, it's kind of what we deserve. <laughs> Taking so much damage on this floor. Okay. Uh, we will look for a secret room. I believe there may be one here. Nope. Um, oh, that's so dumb again. Man, okay. So infinitely stupid damage, but it's fine. Okay, so we get greed here. Oh, that would have been beautiful. That was beautiful. Okay. And get wrecked, okay. Okay. Oh, that, that's a magician, okay. With the magician, do I feel confident enough to... Wow, I was gonna say, with the Magician, do I feel confident enough to pop the Emperor? That would have been just... wow. Okay... And uh, down to the next floor, I guess. I don't know how... or even if there's a possibility of us winning this run. At the point we're at right now, we're kind of extremely weak, tier-wise. We're basically relying on that bomb fly to do all our damage, but... I mean, this floor is make or break, I guess. I. I really hope we get a uh, deal with the devil. That'd be like awesome. Oh my god, I'm just hoping our bomb just does something here. Oh my gosh. Come on. Yes. Yes. Okay, that was beautiful. Okay. Okay, that worked out quite well actually. Okay, so he should finish those guys off. Nope. Okay, there you go, that's that. Oh man, okay, this bomb fly is doing just like amazing for us right now. Okay. Come on, all these guys are lined up. Hit him. Hit him where it hurts. Oh, that was beautiful. Oh my god, I almost walked in the creep there. Okay. So we got a chest for that, which is a bomb and a penny. These guys are super annoying, but... Hoping our bomb... Okay, there you go, yes. Okay. Oh, that's so dumb. Holy. Yeah, we're just taking ultra dumb damage at this point, I mean. Okay. What is there left? Oh wow, there's actually a turret guy here. Okay, there you go. Uh, we will go to our curse room after the boss room, unless we don't have enough health to survive. We'll definitely go for it. I might have actually... Sh I probably should have been looking out for them actually, because... Honestly, I should probably rely more heavily on them to win this run than item rooms, it seems, but... I guess that just didn't happen. Let's get rid of these guts over here. And there we go, we get a bomb for that. We're getting so many bombs, but honestly this, this familiar is just taking care of all our bomb needs when it comes to uh, enemies dying anyways. This guy just has to hit him once. There you go, that was just beautiful. And now they're quite weak. Oh, that was so dumb again. Oh, okay, there you go. That was a lot more complicated than probably should have been. Okay. And there you go. Um, I'm really hoping I actually get more bomb effects at this point, because we're relying on it so heavily. Oh my, oh yes, that was beautiful. Okay. Oh, damn. 
<laughs> I'm complaining so much just running about the damage I'm taking, but I mean I haven't really played any different any differently, so I guess really I'm I'm to blame really, but let's go here. This is what this is. Pisces, tears up plus knockback shot. The tears up was nice. Uh that's about all I have to say for that item. <laughs> the shot speed up, yeah sure I guess. That's okay. Okay. Ah, uh, yep, okay. As soon as I, like, realized those guys fired Brimstone, I knew I was going to take damage. Now, what is this? Little baggy. Extra pill room. That's another health up, actually. So that's crazy. What's this? That's health. What's... What? I think I just got another health up for that. Uh, extra pill room. Unless that just gives us two... Two, t two times the same pill that we pick up. I'm not sure because it said extra pill room. So maybe yeah, maybe it just gives us uh, two two times the pill that we pick up, which is kind of crazy because we have a health up this run. That that's actually game changing in our situation. That might be just crazy. All we need to do is fill up our health bars, really. That could have been like ultra stupid damage. Okay. So here we go. Here's the comeback. The comeback will be real. Uh, I will use a bomb here just because. That red chest may have something of value. Okay, nope. That pill may be good though. So what is this? I found pills. Okay, so that was pointless. And we get another half heart here. Okay, so let's see what our boss is. Monstro 2. It's a huge pain in the ass, I guess, but... I'm at a bump cut of actually hitting there. Oh man, also our tears are kind of pushing him away from the bomb, which is... Honestly, it's kind of funny at this point. Although we did get a spirit heart for that. Should I have picked that up? I'm not sure. I'm not sure if there's even a chance of us getting a deal with the devil at this point anymore, but... It's always worth a shot, I guess. really done damage but oh god hit him hit him hit him okay yes now I'm not sure if there are ways of actually just destroying bosses and something like there was in the first game where you could have just like baited this guy to do what you want but yeah I think I think deal with the double territory is basically like I mean it will not it just won't happen at this point, and just taking way too much damage. That was some really nice damage by the bomb there. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so we just got a health up for that, so... Oh, man. We do have a lot of health now, though, so that's, that's quite nice, but... I don't really know what to say beyond that for this run. So much time completing this run though, it's kind of crazy actually. That's an instantly gone room. We have some pretty nice shot speed, so it's not it's not really a problem catching up to these guys' brains once they turn around. So that's gone. I'm not sure where the bomb fly fl uh, spawns every time it, it respawns. And that was nice. What is it? Is this Curse Skull? It is Cursed. Okay, so I don't think that's much of a problem because we have Red Hearts, but... Oh man. Yeah, we, we will do this, honestly. We will do all of this. I was really hoping this would be one of those red rooms that seems to give us really great items when we walk in the middle. Okay, so we get Flatworm for that. So yeah, that's actually, that's probably better than Curse Skull. But yeah, I'm really digging those uh, those two key rooms. They seem to be really worth kind of every time. They seem to pay for themselves. Okay. The 
these guts. I mean, we're not doing very much damage at all. What is this? Lo uh, lost contact shielded tears. Okay, so suddenly we have huge shielded tears. I'm like, okay, this is getting interesting really quickly. Now, I'm not sure if if tier size actually affects the hit box, because I don't think it did in uh, Wrath of the Lamb. But I guess we'll have to see. If it does, I mean, this is amazing. Even if it doesn't, our tiers seem kind of kind of huge at this point, so it's pretty cool. Rainbow Poop, I have no idea what it does, if there is any purpose to it. But every time I see it, I take it out. Okay. I think all we really need is one hit from this bomb fight, and both of them will probably die. These guys are super weak. So yeah, there you go, that guy's dead. And there you go, he's dead as well. I believe, okay, so now we have shielded here, so we actually shouldn't worry that much about uh, taking upfront dumb damage, I guess. We have massive shielded tiers actually, so that's pretty crazy. Oh my god, how did, how did he miss all that? Okay. This guy's a shit ton of health. There you go. That's not. Oh my gosh, of course we activate a freaking turret by doing that. Yeah, those guys just get wrecked by shield tears. Okay. Uh, on to the next floors, I guess. Oh my gosh, uh, I don't know how we got all the health back. I did not really notice, but that's kind of crazy. So we have six hard containers. If we get a deal with the devil, we could basically pick up everything in the room. So that's quite nice. Oh man, okay. Okay. Oh my gosh, uh, this is confusing as fuck. I am more worried about the fire hitting me than I am about the enemies in this room. But I have shielded tears, so if they do fire towards me, I can just kind of stand there and hope to god like that, that <laughs> the tears save me. I, there's a bunch of pills in this room. Hopefully some of them are good. Okay. What's this? Luck down. That's health down, and this is what? That's paralysis. So that's terrible if there are enemies in the room, I guess, but there were no enemies. I do have a health down pill now. Oh, God, that was so down. I'm not sure how anal the game is about taking red heart damage when it comes to a deal with level. Yeah, I'll just pop this right here. And like immediately take damage. <laughs> God damn it. Oh man, I should have just stood still and you probably wouldn't hit me. Okay. And there you go. Let's see what our shop contains. Whatever this is. Fanny pack filled with goodies. So I'm not quite sure what that did. I'll pick this up to see what it is. That's a health up, so that was actually extremely worth. And we got Maggie for that. So that's really nice. The tank. Okay. Challenge number 10. Cursed. Okay, so that was really cool. There you go. That is Maggie. So if anything, at least we got Maggie this run, I guess. Uh, so let's, let's play this guy, definitely. Golden key. Oh god, no! Why? Okay. Oh yes, okay. Okay, so that was really nice. Our tears just look so cool right now. Huge shields like going towards the enemy. Okay. Oh man, this is going to be annoying. Actually, bomb. Okay, that was apparently super easy. Let's take all this. Okay. Is 
This is a terrible location to decide to like stop, but there's the other zombie. There you go. Okay, that pill might be worth, but I'm not gonna risk it honestly. Hopefully this freezes her in the middle of the screen. Yes it does. Should we can place a bomb here? Oh yes, okay, that was nice. God damn it. This guy's just like following me around. Oh god. Honestly, I'm not sure if the t just using the bomb for its tear effect is worth it in this room. Because it seems to do damage enemies, it could kill those flies, the effect did kill those flies, so... That may actually be super useful. So I will do that, because I think it is super useful. Oh wow, that was, that was really nice damage by the bomb, but I think it also damaged me. Okay... Oh, that was so dumb. We may just die on mom here. Oh man, we're dead. Well, that was disappointing, but I guess kind of expected. I mean, that first that first floor I feel really destroyed. So that might just be like an excuse, but that first floor really I feel it did destroy us. But anyways, guys, thanks for taking the time to watch this. Uh, my name is Pomegranate. Don't forget to like, favorite, and subscribe if you'd like to see more content like this. And uh, thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time.